Hi friends, welcome to 5W's channel. Subscribe to this channel and press the bell icon to get more videos. This video covers the basic information you should know about cell biology. Today in this video, you will see the introduction of cell, discovery of cell, types of cell, shape of cell, size of cell and conclusion at the end of this video. Most of the people are confused between protoplasm and cytoplasm. So, at the end of this video, you will get full knowledge in this topic and you can easily make the difference between two. So, watch the video till the end. Introduction of Shell What is Shell? Shell is small basic unit of life responsible for all life processes. It is also called building blocks of life or basic fundamental unit of life. But before coming to cell biology, we should know what life exactly is. A distinctive characteristic of a living organism from a death organism or non-living thing as specially distinguished by the capacity to grow, metabolize, respond, adapt and reproduce. So now we know that cells are the body's smallest structural and functional unit. Cells are grouped together to form tissue. Different tissues are grouped together to form organs and organs are grouped together to form system, each of which performs a set of related functions that maintain homeostasis and contribute to the health of the individual. The human body develops from a single cell called the zygote, which results from the fusion of ovum and spermatozoa. Discovery of Cell In 1665, Robert Hooke examined a clear piece of cork looks like small rooms and named those small rooms as cell. But those are only dead plant tissue without protoplasm. Later, in 1674, Anthony von Leeuwenhoek examined four single cell organism. He noticed some movement of the cell. He concluded it as alive. Now we come to the next topic that is types of cell. Based upon the development of nucleus, cell is mainly divided into two categories. One prokaryotic cell and another is eukaryotic cell. And there also mesokaryotic cell is present. Those type of cells that are intermediate between prokaryotic and eukaryotic cell. Pro means old and karyote means nucleus. So in prokaryotic cell, nuclear envelope is not present and also nucleolus is not present. Cell size varies between 0.1 to 0 0.5 micrometer. Some example are bacteria, bluegin algae, etc. Humans new and carrot means nucleus. So in eukaryotic cell proper nucleus is present and nuclear envelope is also present in this type of cell. Example, protista, plants, animals. Depend upon 
नंबर ऑफ सेल्स द टू टाइप ऑफ ऑर्गेनिज्म इज सेन वन यूनिसेलुलर एग्जाम्पल एमिबा एंड अदर मल्टी सेलुलर एग्जाम्पल ह्यूमन्स सेप ऑफ सेल सेल्स आर ऑफ वेरियस सेप्स लाइक राउंड स्फेरिकल इलांगेटेड सेल्स आर यूजली कवर्ड बाय अ मेम्ब्रेन कॉल्ड प्लाज्मा मेम्ब्रेन और सेल मेम्ब्रेन इट गिव्स पॉपर सेप टू द सेल साइज ऑफ सेल सेल्स आर वेरी टाइनी एंड ऑफन कर्न सी इन नेकेड आई सो वी यूज माइक्रोस्कोप टू magnify it smallest cell size varies between 0.1 to 0.5 micrometer and larger cell is an ostrich egg it is about 15 cm long and 18 cm wide conclusion at the end I love to tell you a fascinating property that cell has that is property of regeneration by the process of healing so now the time comes to finish your confusion between protoplasm and cytoplasm protoplasm includes the cytoplasm nucleus and other organelles but cytoplasm includes all the contents inside the cell membrane excluding the nucleus so protoplasm equal cytoplasm plus nucleus and cytoplasm equal protoplasm minus nucleus if you like the video please like comment share and subscribe my channel and also suggest me some topics which you want to know more in details